Well, hello YouTube. This video is not going to be as good as I had hoped. I have run into a couple of snags today. I went to set up my lighting and for some reason it doesn't want to turn on. I don't know if it's the bulb, which I've tried a couple of bulbs, so I don't think it's that. I don't know if it's the lighting stand. I have no idea what's going on there. Secondly, my iPad, I hope, isn't too shaky as I'm holding it because my oldest son has been taking a photography course at school and has been using my tripod. And I can't seem to find it today. So I've been wanting to update you guys on stuff and update my dolly stuff because there has been changes. Over the last few months where I haven't posted any videos or anything. Um, life has been crazy. My weeks are going crazy. I have one kid that doesn't want to go to school. I have another kid that wants to go to school but hasn't been feeling overly great off and on. Um, I have weekends where it's supposed to be for me and then something comes up that I'm busy. So, my mom has had a lot of time off work in the past couple months, so she's been here on my weekends that I don't have children and we've just been doing fun things. So now that it's November, now that it's back to Christmas season at her work, she's getting more hours and my kids are at their dad's and this is the first weekend I've had to myself in a very long time. So I am holding my iPad so I'm going to apologize if Lucky just jumps in and out of the screen as he is still my crazy puppy. <laughs> but I love them to death. Um, I don't know. Man, I don't even know where to start. Dolly collection. When it comes to dollies, my dolly collection has been changing. I've recently sold a head, a body, and one of my boy MSD dolls. So actually... That being said, I have no MSDs left in my collection right now. Um, I have a MyU MSD body that I have up for sale. Um, I was going to pull it out of the box and show you guys it today to see if there's anyone on YouTube that's interested in buying it. Reasons for selling is it doesn't get used, it's been sitting around, and someone might as well love her body. She is gorgeous, she is tanned, I just haven't found the right head, and the head that I did buy for her over the last six months, I did not like it on her, on the body, so I sold the head, and now I'm rehoming the body. Um... I don't know if I'll get a YouTube video with it on, but I do have it posted on Facebook and many of the sites. Um, I will... I haven't posted it in my actual Facebook YouTube page, which... Well, I haven't done anything on that page in a very long time, so I don't know if anyone's even still following that one. Um... I do have a couple of dollies sitting here on the couch with me that I got back in May at Doll North. Um, one actually I got before Doll North, but his first reveal was at Doll North. I um, bought him off of Nerdy Doll Girl back in like the beginning of May. And then I got a little doll, a baby doll. Um, BJD at 
Dull North. So they have been sitting together in my room on my shelf and I do have a storyline that I want to write up for them but just haven't had the time. He still doesn't have a face up. He is sitting here without a wig on. He did have a wig on at Anime North but it's since fell off and I just have not had time to do anything with him. Um, I'm hoping to get a face up on him when the Mayu body sells. That's kind of my goal. My baby doesn't have a face up either and I'm not sure if I'm really going to put a face up on her. Um, I haven't named her yet. My boy did get a name, um, Anime North Weekend, and, um, I believe, so he is Carmichael, and he is a doll family H doll, so I'm going to just pull him over and hopefully not make the video too wobbly while I move things around and try to get him in, um, the picture. Of course, my lighting again is not good. I have the curtain open and natural lighting coming in and that's about all. So yeah, this is Carmichael without his wig. I have a blonde wig that it suits him perfectly. Um, and yeah, so this is Carmichael who needs a face up and is in the storyline with him and the baby. He is a single dad who happened to find the baby on a doorstep, on his doorstep. It was just left there. And so I will pull the baby now. Um, the late person that I bought her off of had crocheted her a cute little outfit and little hat and a cute little blanket. So this is her blanket. So he found her wrapped in her blanket in a box on his doorstep and they have bonded quite well. They sit nicely but she has not been given a name in her legs or doing something funky here while I play with her trying to get her to come on camera. So, this is my baby. I am sorry, I do not remember um, who she's made, what company made her. I do have her box, but it's under my bed and I didn't feel like digging it out yet. But she is just so sweet. And I will try to, one of these videos, next time I'm under my bed, pull out her box and figure out what company she was made by. But she is just so adorable. And like I said, she doesn't have a face up, but she doesn't need a face up. She's just a sweet little girl. So she needs a name to go with Carmichael. And to go with the story of being found on a doorstep. I know it sounds sad, but one day I'm. there will be a love in their, his life that will take her in and become her mommy. I just don't have that all figured out yet. I am somewhat looking for an SD girl doll. Um... That would go well with their story but I haven't found her and well I'll be honest the cash isn't there for me to buy her so that is Dolly Life those are my newest and they were bought back in May <laughs> um oh there was Lucky's tail for a quick moment so Dolly Life, Real Life, Updates, 
Today is not my day. I came home to do something on my computer and it doesn't want to turn on. We had heavy winds and power outages the other night, so I'm hoping that it didn't destroy the power <laughs> somehow. I don't know. Well, I'll have to look on that and see what's going on. Um, I don't know if you've seen the latest video of Nerdy Doll Girls, which I was in, and at the end she kind of let out that I've started a new business at home. It's um, Enyo. Lucky, what are you chewing on? Sorry, he's chewing on something over there. Don't. That's the boys. Don't chew on it. Um, yeah, it's Enyo. It's a uh, cleaning with fibers and water. No chemicals to chemical get chemicals out of your house. I will probably be do videos on Enyo um, on my Facebook for sure. I'm not sure how much I will pull into my YouTube video, but I may add, or videos, I may put a few on here, especially if anyone is interested in learning about Enyo and chemical free cleaning. It's easy. It's time saving. It's money saving in the end. It is an investment up front, but it's money saving, honestly. Um, so with that being said, I'm going to leave it at that and I'm going to, I'm so sorry this video is not as exciting as I had hoped it would be, um, for my first video back in a while. I'm just having one of those days where nothing wants to work out. <sighs> my hair just is everywhere. Needs dying, needs love, needs tender, tenderless. Um, it's rainy, it's gross outside, so my insides just kind of feel the same way today. Nothing's working out. Um, but yeah, that's my dolly days, dolly info. I'm going to do in the next little while maybe two weeks from now I'm not sure what's happening in two weeks um a total update on my dolls like I had planned to do today I just can't not with the tripod not being around not with my lighting not working but I wanted to show you all my dolly stuff like updates there's not a whole lot new um but I just wanted to recap what I have for you guys and I will all right well sorry to be such a downer in this video I hope all is well with you guys any name suggestions for my baby would be greatly appreciated I will definitely take them into account um yeah so hope you guys are having a good day we'll talk to you soon bye for now